hell are you doing? I'm sore. Sore? You know what you should have done? Yes. Less exercise, you what? freak of nature. Well, I have done less exercise this week. Yeah. To try and rest, to try and rest a bit for next Saturday. Mm-hmm. I wasn't sure if it was this weekend or next weekend you went away. Next week. Next week. Cool. 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 Uh, I just. Need... the time I get. Sorry. Go ahead. What? What was the time I get into Glasgow? Just coming back. One a.m. Not that bad. Not that bad. Eight uh, p.m. Okay, that's okay. That's not too bad. Oh, um, cool. it's because our our boat and ferry is the half two one. I think checkout is eleven o'clock. Okay, that's quite late. You have like. Uh, it's for the. It's not essentially a hotel. It's. I don't know what what the women's team are in, but the men are in a. Like, uh, hostel. We, we've got two service departments, like those oh. ones. That's what it's called. It's like, Cornea Service Department. Interesting. So we. We're in them. I don't know. Oh, They're no. loud what? tonight. Jesus. They are. Did you get a mic or a headset or something? No, I've, I've opened my window. Right, okay, I, okay. No, but that was a wild, wild car that went past. Mm. Yeah, so, we... Cause it's basically, how she worded the message is... We're most likely sharing a bed. Oh, lucky you, Rowan. I'm just going to be one second. There's a... Uh, uh, we got a Noah... Like, Noah's Ark, like, uh, money box. Um, I can't remember if it was from you or for, from Elliot. Uh, I will tell you, I haven't bought you anything. Okay, so it must be from Elliot. And um, it, uh, it is just tall enough... Uh, to be in the way of the TV, but it's also quite nice. So I keep taking it off of the table with the TV, and he only keeps putting it back up. So I will just be one second. I just need to move it. You could move it without actually. Yeah, I wouldn't know any wiser. Yeah, because the way she was saying, because she was saying there's, <laughs> well, it's a double bed in each room, two rooms to one apartment, four rooms booked. Hello. What are you saying? I thought I heard you back there before. So I was saying, the message essentially going, it's a double bed in each room. Uh huh. Two room apartments and two apartments have been booked. Cool. Oh, it's really probably going to have to be sharing. That's all right. Your your handball team, yeah. Handball, yeah. It's not you. It's not the scouts where you're going to be a scout leader sharing a bed. Well, that would that would never happen with. Scouts. I hope not. I hope not. Because you can. For the same groups, you can get away with it. Yeah. Oh, that 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 would never even be allowed to pass. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. There's a joke in there somewhere. I'm too mature to say it, Rowan. Oh, I I know. <laughs> I know. That's what I'm saying. Like, if you're not stating how accommodation is going to be happening, that's not getting through. No, hundred percent. Because it's at best shady looking. Maybe not shady, but it's like you need, it's protection-wise. Like, is it the dock? 
No, someone will go up again. Oh, okay. It is full. Ooh. What you ash? Who is it? Um, no, yeah. I I had triple on wheels. Okay. You you go not to get into the gen. No where ah, I see. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I'm gonna turn my volume up a little bit. Full bar. Okay, so like, that's fully in there so that it's protection of everyone involved. Hmm. If you don't say accommodation, even if you just forgot to say accommodation, not being approved. Sensible. I like it. Legion. A legion. It's a joy, not a friend. Ooh. Understandable. But it's not a friendly legion. <laughs> Noted. Coming in for the save. Yeah, you got the flashbang on me. Yeah. That's why Neil got the just badly got the flashlight on the side of his head. Yeah, you two heal up. I need to open a chest. So I, was, I played a bit more Resident Evil today. Yeah. Uh, which one is it? The first one. Or... One. Uh. Now, also, I knew he was the video I saw. Because what's actually hard to find is the um, garden door. The what one? Garden door in the main hall. Uh, are you meaning to the to the cemetery or the cemetery, or the yeah. downstairs one? Thank you very much. Oh, never mind. I believe. Cemetery. Super. Yeah, I got you. So I was trying to find it for a while. It's like, oh, I need this key, but I don't want to have the key. Oh. Gosh, wheels. So do you know that there's a way to tell um, whether or not um, they've DC no! <laughs> they've DC normally or DC um, by being a baby? And it's the blood spatter behind ah. it. Ah. I am getting stuck on literally everything. Is the blood spatter ah. they've been a baby. The blood spatter is they've been a baby, yeah. If there's no blood splatter, then uh, they just DC. Ah. Yeah. Yeah, bad connection. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's fine. I'll look out for that. So yeah, can... so now we know. I could just go down the normal floor and baby. Yeah. To be fair, I imagine if I turn my PlayStation off, then, uh, then I would still get, um... 
I, like I wouldn't get a blood splatter, and I definitely was a baby, so. Ah. Fuck, I was so close to that play. Just gonna so, heal. I, I had to like YouTube it, because I was like, I'm going round and round, and I can't get any further. Mm -hmm. I don't know what this door is that I need these keys for. And I, I found out in the chapter I was in, it talks about Rebecca when you meet her. Yeah. So I was like, okay, that I, I already knew what what was the outcome of Ooh. Richard anyway. Yeah. So because I had it done, like I, I basically walked around because I was trying to avoid progressing in the story. Yeah. And get everything I can first. Yeah. And yeah. I'm Sorry? Uh, end up getting the wrong, the wrong room. Progress the story. So I was like, okay, that's fine. I can head back to. I can head. I can get the serum to him, and just give him the serum. Yeah. You get an achievement for it. It's a secret achievement. Yeah. Do you know what the achievement is called? I can't remember what it is. It I can't remember what the achievement is called. I don't know if it's head. the same for PlayStation, but the Did way it! Woo! Ah! Hey, there's no power here. There's no power. The achievement you get literally tells you, yeah, you, he's gonna die. Yeah. Light! Uh, he knew he was gonna die anyway, I saw that in the comments. Like, if you get to him after five minutes, he's dead. Yeah, I didn't know that the first time. He knew that, so that's how I was like, oh, I'll see what the story was like. Yeah. I didn't know that Rebecca becomes a healer for you. She's the medic. Yeah, she's the medic. Oh. I didn't know why you could go to her and she'll kill you. Wait, what? <laughs> she'll heal you if you go to her? I only found this out because I went back into the room to put an item away. And she like, if you walk close enough to her, she's like, oh. Chris, do you have any wounds you need to kill me? Or you can kill me? I don't think she ever said that to me. It has to be the medical storage room you're in. This is in the remake. This is in the most recent one, yeah, the remake. Okay. Hmm, how interesting. No, I don't know anything about that. Oh, I, I think it's if you get the serum to him in time. Right. Well, that would explain it, to be fair. Because then that wouldn't go towards the bad ending if you let someone die. Hmm. Uh, there's like 16 endings. Yeah, I know. I know one of the bad ending and the bad, bad ending is in prison. Uh, I only know the one ending. Don't also don't tell me, but uh, no, like I didn't realize there were sixteen endings because the ending I had felt very normal. <laughs> like it was like, well done, we did it, blah blah blah, let's go home, and then it was like one of sixteen. And I went, oh. oh I I think it depends on how you play. I think. So I think there's eight per uh, character. Makes sense. And then, oh no, Rowan. Uh. Rowan, I have a no mither challenge. Put <laughs> them to DC. What? Bully them. And force them to DC. Oh no. While using only the perk gnome either. Oh my good golly gosh. What am I gonna do without my exhaustion perk, Rowan?
No miser. It starts with a and not a B he. So I'm she can going... only heal you three times with it. Ah. Interesting. Oh, thank God. I... Wait, I think I've got the assault shotgun. I'm just gonna. You have the assault shotgun. Yeah, because I have a shotgun. I think it's the assault one. Super. Everybody needs a big I stupidly wasted a heal. Fuck. You stupid idiot. I didn't know it was limited until she said. You fat oh, fuck. There's only so much I can do this. <laughs> I, I just saw Google there three times. I have two left. <laughs> oh, that's okay. That's oh, okay. no, because if I knew, knew I had a limited amount, I wouldn't have done it. Maybe I knew and I used them all. Who knows, Rowan? Who knows? All right, everyone, we've got a no by their gamer here, so let's just all be super kind to me. Six minutes to get the serum. Yeah, I, yeah. So if you think you can explore and then give them the thing later, you'd be wrong. I mean, it's because I learned, I can literally run across a main hall. Get it from the upstairs. Room. But there was a scary zombie in the way for me. There was no, one of those dead. scary red ones, and I was like, No! Oh, the Crimson ones. I've only killed one so far. Is it... I, I got the achievement for it, but technically it doesn't count in this game because <laughs> I was playing yesterday, I went outside, zombie dog attacked. Got it. I was like, yeah. it's too late for Resident Evil. I, I, I can completely relate. Completely <laughs> relate. I'm gonna get in trouble by my fly if I keep playing it. Cause I've, I've not been able to play online games for the past few days. Oh no? Yeah. How come? I to reset the Xbox. Mm. What, did it have a red ring? Did the new no, Xbox, was... Xboxes get red rings? The old ones did when it yeah. was dead. And it was about to die. Yeah, I remember Robert turned his Xbox off when he got a red ring and he put it back on. And the red ring went away. And he was like, excellent. <laughs> it's like that saved me like 80 pounds, thank God. <laughs> Oh, Rebecca's death is a possible cutscene in Resident Evil. Uh, yeah. She didn't die for me, because I'm, I'm not bad at games, Ron. So, just remember that. I got no either. Except Richard died for you without sacrificing. Yeah. I'm Look, a no either gamer. It, it says... If you're playing as Chris or Jill, he ends up dying with it, like the thing. I was like, yeah, no. Did they end up saving when I did it yesterday? No, like, it's no, too no. late for Resident Evil, and I'm not not having the dog just attack me there. <laughs> I'm so scared right yeah. now, Rowan. The only reason I was able to kill the crim Crimson Head was that the, the first room you go to when you meet a zombie on the west wing. Yeah. 
but you've got the fountain or something or the box in the way. Yeah, I remember. And you like pick, you pick you pick up the you pick up the gun. Yeah. Your first gun. Yeah. Uh, the person was trapped. The zombie was trapped on the other side of the box. Uh, so it's got hundred low that by the way. Go ahead there. That I just kept shooting. You just kept shooting. And killed it. You came out blasting, did you? Yes. Got the achievement. Very nice, very nice, very nice. But I, I, I turned off before I saved it because I'm now not. I'm not doing that, but. <laughs> yeah. We killed it without it actually being registered in the save file now. Come on, finish it. Super. Alright. But I know that if I go down back to that area, that zombie is alive again. Yeah. I kinda wish there was a warning about Crimson Heads before you get to them. Yeah, me too. Uh, there actually is. There actually is in the crypt. Is there a way? Sorry? Rowan, let, let her eat it here. There you go. I'll work on the Jane. That was not fun. Because they, they can hear you from upstairs. Even if you're not running. They can hear you from a long way away. I also forgot they can go up, they can travel upstairs. Uh, yeah, they can, yeah, 100%. I think they can also break down doors, or maybe that's uh, a different monster. Wait, so my safe zone door might not be a safe zone? They can go into the safe rooms. But uh, I don't even know if this is true, but I'm pretty sure there was a door in a place where uh, a loop had uh, where um, there is no long there was no longer a door after. Oh, I know no. And I know. 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 Literally, Nemesis just opens the door and comes in. Uh, I don't know where you where you're talking about. I think it's outside. It's one of the alley rooms. I cannot remember. It was in the remake. I mean, I believe you, for the record, I believe you, I just can't think when that happens. I should have lost the bench. Okay, so I found Huntress Lullaby. Cool, let me grab that. I'm not uh, grabbing you. Oh, okay, well someone's opening a chest. Okay. I know where... Chris Lullaby is, I'm grabbing you. Super. You don't die. You grab that. I love okay, so Friday, Thursday, the air after his last adventure. Yeah. And we returned in like the last five minutes. No, no. To join no, Dash no. again. No, no, oh. my God, no, no, no! <laughs> <laughs> Guess who returned? <laughs> I'm gonna die! <laughs> David, guess who returned? Who returned? 
<laughs> you haven't seen him since the end of season one. Oh, Pidgeot. That's Pidgeot. cool. And Tracy, but speaking. Very nice. No, also, this is this was Tracy's first speaking return. Return speaking. In the last. Oh no no no! no. <laughs> he made appearances but never spoke in role. That's alright. Crazy yeah. return yeah. speaking. What? Oh, oh yeah, of course, because he watched their matches and stuff. Yeah. And like he'd be like in the background the power camera. Yeah, yeah, I get that. Ooh. But it was actually a speaking role for him, and Pigio right. returned and rescued Pikachu one last time from Team Rocket. With a bunch of Pidgeotto's behind him. Very nice. Which also means the Pidgeys he was project protecting a fault. Mm-hmm. Makes sense. So, so know how him saying like, oh, I'll be back for you now. And he was like, it's been three years we've not seen Pidgeot. Why is he returning? Mm-hmm. That was actually a mistranslation of Japanese dub to the English dub. Really? So they added it in the English dub, but they didn't add it in the Japanese. That checks out. I don't know what it was in the English in the Japanese dub, but he never says, "Oh, I'll be, well, I'll return to you now. Come back." It was maybe just something along the lines of like. Um... I'll see you soon, old friend, or like, something like that. Yeah. Yeah. See you around, so maybe. Like, catch you later, old friend. Yeah, yeah, something like that. I would but imagine. But it's made as, oh, he'll be back soon. Which yeah. then annoyed people, because, like, when is he coming back? Well, that was the problem with quite a few of Ash's uh, releases, is you were sitting there going... I don't know why he's releasing them. Like, or like why he doesn't like why he doesn't go back. Because the thing is, is an optimum time for him to have gotten them back would have been during Battle Frontier, where he's going oh, yeah. through Kanto again. You know what I mean? Oh yeah, like they they really could have brought Pidgeot. I feel like if they gave Pidgeot the Charizard treatment, he would be one of Ash's bosses. Ash That's loves cool. flying types. Does. He has a lot of flying types. Pidgeot was basically his ace in Kanto. Pidgeotto. Um. You, you I... think about how... I, even when he had Char like Charizard, Bulbasaur, Squirtle, you think about the amount of times he used Pidgeotto in a battle. I won't argue with you, but I don't know if I would have described him as uh, Ash's like ace in the hole. <clears throat> it, it was the first first reason, first season. Like, wasn't many Pokemon that could be an ace. No. You know, Abby Kingo became the ace of his Pokemon League journey. I think I think that part of the problem though, Rowan, is that um, in uh, the anime, Ash requires a flying type Pokemon in every region that they go to. And he doesn't require a flying type Pokemon because flying is his favorite type or because they're the strongest Pokemon or anything like that. It's it's entirely because of Team Rocket. Like, Ash needs a flying type Pokemon to find naturally where Team Rocket are. Like, if you watch through the anime, like that's pretty like that's a good portion of what his flying types do is get released, find Team Rocket, and then we'll bomb there. Know what I mean? 
Uh, no, they they're also used for that. But when you're mm. talking first season, I would well, fully first, argue Pidgeotto. First was season, one he of caught them. eight different Pokemon. Right, there was Pikachu, Charmander, Bulbasaur, Squirtle, Pidgeot, oh, Pidgeotto, oh, Caterpie. I'll oh. give him. I'll give him Gengar. Primate. Uh, technically, he never actually caught Haunter. No, 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 Haunter, that's what. Yeah, I know that. Um, primate. And. It Taurus. depends on when you. Yeah, it depends when you count the season. Some as nine? Well. Uh, caught Muck. Muck, ten. Yeah. Uh, and it's if you want to include Orange Island. Orange as, Island uh, is its own separate thing. Well, that's what I was going to say. In Orange Island, if you are including that Snorlax and Lapras. Yeah. If not, then. What yeah. happened to his Snorlax? I uh, went to Professor Oaks. It's still there. Yeah, we we see him all the time every time he goes back. I do not remember him having a Snorlax. Uh, he used him in the Battle Frontier League. Yeah, uh, fair fighting, enough. Fighting yeah, one. I don't, I don't disagree. I just can't remember. Because oh it, it's goodness. funny because people say people did like a comparison of like, oh, Ash's Pokemon oh. at Professor Oaks running to him in this time, oh, the most recent time, and. In, both times it has bay, bay leaf at the front. The second one you just see like Snorlax just charging. I fucking hate Ash's bay leaf. Can I just say that? Fucking hate it. Hate it so much. It's a shite Pokemon. It's a shite Pokemon. Has a shite personality, and it was just shite. All right. What was Charizard in the first season? Charizard in the first season was a dick, not shite. Shite, shite personality. Bayleaf was sh no, 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 no. There's a difference between being a dick and having a shite personality. My examples are uh, Spike and Angel from Buffy. Right? Spike is a dick, but Angel has a shite personality. Do you disagree? Uh, I've got up to season three of Buffy and the last season. The last season is pretty, pretty trash. Gotta be honest. <clears throat> There's so many people who like hang on the... Oh, they went, he went down to kill your gates with the Tara. And I was like, you did that for a reason, so it furthers her storyline. But when she was saying that, I thought, I thought Will died at the end of season six. Uh, no, so Kill the Gaze isn't about, it's Hillbilly by the way. Uh, Kill the Gaze is more, I think it's called Bury the Gaze, but it doesn't necessarily matter. Um, oh, okay, yeah. It's more about you bury their relationship as opposed to the gay people. So, if you kill one of them, you end the relationship without um, without having a gay relationship, if you understand me. And uh, I would definitely not criticize Buffy for that. I um, hey. Mainly because I think Buffy actually has really, really good gay representation. Come on, that, that, that's what I'm saying. Especially like, the time period it came from. I, I didn't like, what's the name? Kendo? Uh, Kendo? The, the, the second of her partners. Really? Yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, she was no Tara. I, I, no, I didn't even like her. No. Remember, I haven't met Tara really by this point. It's all at the end of season 6 and then season 7. Tara is fucking adorable, man. Oh no, I know. I've seen, I've seen clips of her. I, I agree with that. I'm saying, like, 
people started saying that, oh, he's like burying the gaze in that because he killed all the power and got rid of the legend illusions. It's like, that was the point of the storyline. I mean, because I agree with the story the great gaze trope if it's always the gay character to die. I, I agree with that, of people kind of be like, yeah, it's not really fair, I agree. But people start saying that when it happens to one gay character, maybe two, and you're like, it's like a war situation. If they don't die, then that's war armor. This is true. <sighs> Poor Rebecca's just being killed. She is, isn't she? Hey! It means it gets you surviving. Yeah, I mean... Yeah, I guess. Wow, dude, that, that's not exactly a positive to me, dude. I mean, like, I'm not going to let her die. Rowan. <laughs> quick, quick on agreeing there. For fuck's sake. I'm not toxic, you're toxic. What happened to your positive fives? <laughs> positive fives? What's positive five? What the hell does that mean? Or exactly positive if you let her, if you agree uh -oh. that oh, her no. not dying, her being killed saves you from dying. I mean, that is a fact though. A toxic one. Glyphs. Oh shit, what are you doing? Glyphs. Watch it, what glyphs? What? What kind of glyphs? L. <laughs> Rolling, go pick her up. It's probably not a trap. Pick her up after the gen stuff. He's been toying with her. I'm gonna get her. That's not the first time she's been down. Yeah, no. Oh, he got picked up. Oh no, she just got up. I'm not sure if she had Unbreakable or if Steve got her. Hey, bro. I... The Ash Catchers are flying type Pokemon very early on as well. Um, I mean, Slime isn't that tight. What? Slime isn't that tight. Flying. Flying, yes. Sorry, my apologies. Quick to the killer shack! Dun, 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 dun. I'm getting yeah. stuck on your fat ass. Rowan, do you promise to protect me if the killer comes? It's also hillbilly, so... Yeah. Damn, you weren't behind me. <laughs> Why don't you hide? Why don't you hide? Okay. I will hide. Do what I do and hide. I am hiding. Hey look, my earphones have love hearts on them. That's cute. Yeah, it's his fountain. It's his fountain. Quick, open the door! Alright, guess we have to leave. Well done, Roy. I, I still stand by that. I I feel Pidgeotto was for a good part of se the first season was Ash's eights were cancelled. I can accept that. I do think you might be wrong, but I appreciate I, I understand your your mindset of it. Oh Charizard would have been the ace if he had listened to Ash. Yeah, uh, to be fair though, I think if Charizard had listened to Ash, Ash would have uh, won that league. So, Maybe well, he would have lost to Gary, but Gary lost. No, Gary was out at that point, wasn't he? Huh? To so Gary going like next. This so was only like the top 32. Hmm. This was literally Ash's first. No, second match of the league. I'm sure it wasn't his third. Second or third? Hmm. All I know is that Toros and. Tauros was the 8th of the 
Orange Island. Orange Island League. England was the ace of the... Again, I don't feel like you're using ace correctly. Dude, I, I don't agree with ace being the most prominent one, because the ace should be kind of the underdog, the one that surpassed everyone, like... It Isn't was basically undefeated. Yeah. Remember, Ash sent out Wait, Krabby what? in the league. The only time he had hit, ever used Krabby by that point. Yeah. The falls and annihilates the whole team by himself. That is very true. Same, same with Tauros. You know, like Tauros or Snorlax dominated the Orange Island. Yes. Well, again, I don't think he he didn't dominate the Orange Islands. He was just dominated the league. I mean, I, I mean, did he? Did he though? They're one of Ash's Pokemon with a high win rate, high win low loss rate. Boom, circle of healing. And so all, uh, all Pokemon, you'd be like, oh, they wouldn't have a high win rate. They do. Mm hmm. Octal's one of them. Which, I, by the way, Ash doesn't even have a shiny version of Noctowl. Yeah, he does. He has a different version, not the official shiny. Shiny! If I'm correct, that's not Noctowl's actual shiny. Okay. Also, it's a massive Noctowl. That is very true. I. No, wasn't it small? But it's bigger than normal knockouts. Okay. Mm -hmm. Boo, 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 boo. All right, let's go. Wait, no, no, it wasn't. It was not I don't know where I saw that. You idiot. I mean, remember, Gen 2 was the first time shiny Pokemon were introduced. Are you sure? Are you sure that wasn't Gen 1? Oh, because of the color sprite, color they added to the sprite in Gen 2. Still able to make them shiny. Oh uh, yeah, they were all grey, weren't they? Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Go take my bear! Just, just, just as there was no reading in Gen 1, because there was no gender, apart from Nidoran. You mean Nidorino? <laughs> no, I mean Nidoran. Nidoran male, Nidoran female. That was funny. Because that's why people are convinced of the theory Littles are failed clones of Mew. Nidorinos. Oh, Littles. That's probably true, to be fair. Oh, well, they're the All same right, size. I'm ready. They're the same I'm color. I'm ready. Both shiny and non shiny. They're the same <laughs> weight. And they're the only two Pokemon that can learn Transform. And when Ditto was introduced, it wasn't actually introduced for breeding. Because there was no there was, cold wind! Because there was no eggs until eggs are breeding until Gen 2. Yes, why well, I there might, been, there might have been like one egg you get, I don't know, but he didn't wasn't introduced to gold and silver. 
What wasn't introduced? Reading. Reading. When you stick your two Pokemon, your Pokemon with the digital game. Reading, or... right. Give gotcha. me an egg. Yeah. And come around till Gen 2. Hmm. Which then bring to purpose, what was the purpose? The point, what was the purpose of Ditto then if it wasn't for breathing from Gen 1? I mean, he's just a cool Pokemon, isn't he? See, he, he's a clone, he's a failed clone of Mew, that's why. I mean, still pretty cool Pokemon, isn't he? Also, this has, a, this has annoyed me for years. Your face? Why is... So they knew the existence of Mew 2. And so right. it's, it's, They knew the existence of Mew 2. Which means... They knew the existence of Mew. Yep. Why is Mew 2 150 and Mew is 151 despite Mew 2 being a clone of Mew? Well, who knows, Rowan? It's maybe just that it's a game and they made a mistake. So that plan is like, the whole point is like, oh, there's 150 Pokemon. They're like, you're trying to get me to find a Pokemon called Mew 2, mm -hmm. which we've established as a clone right now. So why, why is it 150, not 151? Yeah. And we have a face camper to be the day. Yeah, I can see that. <laughs> Is he still there? I saw him turn invisible. Did he leave though? He moved now. Nah, he's on his way over. He's on his way over. Move me on! Oh! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! What? The bait saved me. Well done. Help me, Leon! Don't be rude. Don't be rude. No, 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 no. Thank you very much, my dear. Help me, Leon! Um, I need to find a totem so that I can boom and be like a super cool teammate that everyone's proud of. You know? I think you should shove that boon up your ass. I don't think it would fit, mate. I don't bloody think it would fit. Fuck off with your camping ass! There he's left. No, he doesn't left. Alright. Fuck off, you camper. Go, go, go! Thank you, team! Thank you! 
Very nice! Rowan, if you head to the boom, it's shadow step and circle of healing. Oh, you're just gonna tell me it's shadow step. No, shadow step and circle of healing. So we're all good. He really fucked that up there, Rowan, did you see? He missed me, hit you, and then those two came in with a body block. But before that, he hit the hay bale as well. That was a very unfortunate moment for him. There you go, baby. Are you guys going for the save? Rowan, maybe you come to the gen and I'll go for the save. Okay, never mind. Carry on my way, we're done. For the save. Okay. But well, remember, he's camping. Yeah, I know. Carry on my way, what's up? There'll be peace when you are done. Lay your weary head to rest Don't you cry no more You lied, David! You said you had shadow head. I mean, it doesn't make you anyway. fucking invisible. <laughs> I know. I'm like saying, like, you told me... <laughs> It would be beneficial to hide from him. I mean, it would be, to be fair. It wasn't. about my daily, daily ritual. What is your daily ritual? Oh, did you do it? Yeah. Right, let's get this. Let's... We still have a gen to do. I thought that was the last gen. I was, I literally just went to the door like a fucking idiot. Go, go, go! Oh, shit! That's a my bad. That's a my bad. I'm very sorry. Ah, 
I guess so. Wraith campers. I think I enjoy them a lot less than like most campers. Does that make sense? You literally can go anywhere without being seen. Why are you camping? Well, I think like you're quick as well. Doesn't matter. Like at all. Just. It's a shame. Alright then. I guess we're done for today. Uh, we are. See you later, Rowan. Have a good trip, because I, I don't think I'll be playing again until then. You'll find time. Well, tomorrow I'm doing my Adept Killer stream. You'll still find time. I might find time. I will do my best. You will. I will do my best. All right. Thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye.